Woke Bill 101, you already know, man. Today we'll be talking about seducing females, bro. Look, 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 look. So, seducing females, I'd say it's 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 not that hard, man. If you've done it more than like 10, I would say more than 7, 8, even 5 times, bro. It. Oh, God, what is that? <laughs> Yo, I just ripped something out of my pants. Hold up, what is that? Damn. Okay, let me get back on top. So it's easy bro it's not that hard and i'm gonna give you my tips and my strategies on what i would do if i was on a date with a female first things first is she's coming to my house or we're going somewhere else like david busters like mini golfing or anything like that i'm gonna be going over uh going on a like a date with her a date i would highly recommend not to go to is movie theaters and eating bro do not take her to eat okay bro do not also don't take her ass to a movie don't give me that corny crap no bro no that's not interacting bro it's just it's trust me that doesn't work so you let me give you some good places where to take her on the first date if you can't take her to your house bro Either Dave and Buster's, mini golfing, bowling, a walk in a park, and anywhere else that involves physical contact, like walking with each other, basically anything that involves teasing each other, like at a playground or something, y'all trying to do stuff. Trust me, girls will take anything. They would much rather have an experience rather than something they normally do on a daily basis with other dudes like eating out watching a movie that's generic so a place i'm extremely good at is david busters man david bust oh my god bro look it is so 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 easy to get more in contact bro like when you're beating her in a game bro you can tease her you can make fun of her you guys get closer like that you guys become more touchy as you get more physical with each other when these games come. You try to mess her up whenever, you know, she's actually beating you with something. That just brings you closer. It's natural, my guy. It brings the inner fun in her and in you. And if you guys do finish business, she's going to feel like it's natural and it just happened. When really, you're just building up the touch barriers during that whole date don't be afraid to like twirl her around to even going for the kiss at times bro i went to the kiss multiple times and it actually happened but it has to be like towards the end sort of you gotta have to build that moment you'll you'll know what happened bro. you'll know and david busters is overall a pretty good place like 12 that's like 12 bucks just for a good hour bro 12 15 bucks bro that is all bro i mean it has more of a an investment to put towards it man but i i don't mind it bro i really don't mind spending 14 15 bucks because i'm not having fun bro i'm not watching some corny ass movie i'm not eating some expensive ass food i'm just chilling having fun playing games i like playing games i'm doing something i like another thing i forgot to mention Always go to a place that you enjoy, all right? And, you know, I could be completely wrong. If you enjoy eating at nice foods and places, take her to that, bro. If you enjoy that more than playing games, bro, okay, you're going to enjoy that more, all right? But from my perspective and from what I've experienced, females enjoy an experience that's interactive. Don't just take her to, like, a generic-ass movie, bro. No one no one is going to be enjoying that, bro. You won't be getting nothing that first date, bro. Confirmed, dog. Confirmed. And let's rewind it all the way back. Say if she got to your house. Bro, you're... <laughs> easy, easy, easy mode, bro. Easy mode, bro. Because with David Busters, bro, you have to make, like, a sort of excuse. You have to, like, put it in. Like, I, usually I would say Rick and Morty to get her over to my house. And then we can hang out more. 
if she's down bro most of the time they are down if you give her that good kiss and that good experience bro she will be down it's easy 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 and once you know she's at the house you continue to build up attraction but let's 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 go back i'm like all over the place right now bro let's go back to like the date right the first date at your house right we're rewinding everything not david busters you induce her in cook the food do the same thing like at david busters bro you tease her you make fun of her you create conversation bro it's not that hard to create conversation one of the main things I always go for in a conversation that always branches off to new and better things is the way she looks, where she's from, and how I think that's whack. Trust me, no matter where she says she's from, say that it's whack. Okay? Tell her how whack it is. It's gonna build a conversation. Most of the time, these girls will say, What? No way, you're whack. Where are you from? Or, no, no, no. And then you just explain your reason. Bro, it's it's not that hard. The more you do it, the easier it becomes, dog. If you can't have, like, a normal conversation with a girl, man, go out right now. Talk to, like, five random females, bro. They don't even have to look fine or anything. Just talk to them, bro. Or if you work at a job, bro, try to maintain a conversation with a female for 10 to 5 minutes without it being awkward. Cause that's what I used to do every single day, bro. When I had work, bro, I want to make sure I have like a conversation with females. I didn't even think they were cute or not. Just have a conversation with them like five, ten minutes. Five, ten minutes. And the more you do it, the easier it gets. The longer you can have that conversation for. And still, I used to experiment, bro, on what to say, what to do. And even though the conversation kind of sucks, even when I'm trying something new, I learn from it. You constantly learn from it, bro. And so, if she's at your house, just build more of a touch connection. Make sure it's more smooth when she's cooking. Go over to her on her side. Just, just lean over, <laughs> bro. Cut for her. Make fun of her, bro. It's Don't be PC with these. I was about to call me more. Don't be PC with these girls, bro. Don't be PC. Do not be PC. By PC, politi- politically correct, yeah, you can say that, but don't be Mr. Nice Guy, okay? Don't want you to act like an, like an asshole, not like a big one. Just act like you don't care about her, bro. She's gonna be all over you. Also be handsy on her too, bro. And other than that, man, if... You don't smash the first date, then it's it's a waste, bro. With me, I'm kind of more of a first date kind of guy. If we don't do nothing the first date, uh, then uh, I guess nothing's really gonna work out for us, man. It's I don't know. I'm kind of picky. There's been some people where I had to go on two dates with, man, and most of the time I got it in. But if I would have to even go on like a third date. For me, man, it's you're just wasting your time, bro. Because you know what you want. You don't want to give them all your attention and all your money when you just want that. And that's just facts. Uh, anyway, I hope y'all learned something from this. Take her somewhere that you like the most. And when you bring her home, watch the movie. And then just, just, you know what to do, bro. You know what your instincts do. Don't rush it. Don't rush it once she's at your house. Don't rush it. She's already there, bro. No rush. Easy mode for days. Easy mode. Uh, Easy mode, bro. Anyway, man. Hope y'all have safe for him. I'll see y'all. Peace. Yeah, and when she rock me. Ooh, and when she rock me. Times fake go back and she talk me. Times fake, I will lay. Times to go, but I just dance.